Hello doctors, welcome to Medicos Diary. Once again, welcome to our 9th video. Don't forget to check the description box for the previous videos. If you think you can, definitely you can. Today, I select practice of medicine for our discussion. So, let's start. First one. Cause of retropharyngeal abscess. Options A. TB spine B. Mastoiditis C. Tonsillitis D. Dental sepsis Answer Option A. TB spine Retropharyngeal abscess most commonly in children below 3 years. It is mainly of two types, acute and chronic. When acute retropharyngeal abscess is due to suppuration of retropharyngeal lymph nodes secondary to infection in the adenoids, nasopharynx, posterior nasal sinus or nasal cavity. Chronic retropharyngeal abscess is due to caries of cervical spine or tuberculous infection of retropharyngeal lymph nodes Secondary to tuberculosis of D cervical nodes. Here the question is cause of retropharyngeal abscess and the option given is TB spine. So the answer is TB spine. Next one. Paradoxical breathing is found in options A. Multiple fracture ribs. Option B. Atelectiasis. Option C. Pneumonia. Option D. Diaphragmatic Paralysis. Answer. Option D. Diaphragmatic Paralysis. During normal inspiration, diaphragm moves downward. But in case of paralysis of diaphragm, when the intrathoracic pressure decreases during inspiration, paralyzed diaphragm paradoxically moves upwards instead of downwards because of the negative intrathoracic pressure. So, in diaphragmatic paralysis, paradoxical breathing takes place. Next one. Jaundice is detected in sclera when bilirubin level more than options A. 2 mg per deciliter B. 3 mg per deciliter C. 4 mg per deciliter. D. 5 mg per deciliter. Answer. Option B. 3 mg per deciliter. The presence of scleral icterus indicate a serum bilirubin of at least 3 mg per deciliter. Next one. Commonest cause of spontaneous pneumothorax is Options A. TB B. Trauma C. Asthma. D. Rupture of subpleural blood. Answer. Option D. Rupture of subpleural blood. Commonest cause of spontaneous primary pneumothorax is rupture of a small subpleural emphysematous bulla or pleural blood or the pulmonary end of the pleural adhesion. Pneumothorax. What is pneumothorax? It is the presence of air in the pleural space. Occurs almost exclusively in smokers which suggest that the patient have subclinical lung diseases. If the recurrent of attack is present, thoracotomy is done. Next one, Vernix encephalopathy which vitamin is deficient? Options A, B1 B, B12, C, B2, D, B5. Answer A. Option B1. Vernix encephalopathy is due to the deficiency of thiamine that is vitamin B1. It usually occurs in alcoholics. It shows triad of confusion, ophthalmoplegia and ataxia. Cerebral form of thiamine deficiency is usually seen in alcoholic. Vernix encephalopathy is another cerebral form of thiamine deficiency. 
which is characterized by confusion bilateral symmetrical ophthalmoplegia in generally the time in deficiency causes beriberi do you know the two type of beriberi yes the first one wet beriberi second one dry beriberi in wet beriberi edema is the most marked feature in dry beriberi it is characterized by peripheral neuropathy okay next one in myocardial infarction which enzyme is first to appear option a cpk option b ldh option c sgot option d tmt answer option a cpk creatinine kinase ck or cpk is the first enzyme raised in plasma after mi its concentration rises after 4 to 6 hours don't forget after 4 to 6 hours after that drug reach at peak after 12 hours and falls to normal within 48 to 72 hours the most sensitive markers of myocardial cell damage are cardiac troponin t and i which are released within 4 to 6 hours and remain elevated for up to 2 weeks next one typhoid in first week detected by option a vidal test option b stool test option c urine test option d blood test answer option d blood test in first week of typhoid blood culture second week of typhoid agglutination test or vidal test third week of typhoid stool culture fourth week of typhoid urine culture is done you can remember this by using a code basu b a s u first week b blood culture second week a agglutination test third week s stool culture fourth week u urine culture okay next one turner syndrome shows following feature option a short stature option b widely spread nipples option c webbing of neck option d all of them answer option d all of them the patient are short stature though not actually dwarf trunk is muscular neck is short and webbed breast is not developed with nipples placed far apart in turner syndrome there are 44 autosomes plus one only one sex chromosome okay next one hemoptysis is seen in a aortic stenosis b pulmonary stenosis c mitral stenosis d tricuspid stenosis answer option c mitral stenosis pulmonary congestion in mitral stenosis may cause cuff and pulmonary hypertension thus leading to hemoptysis because of mitral stenosis there is increased left atrial pressure which causes back pressure in the pulmonary vascular bed leading to pulmonary hypertension this rise in pulmonary vascular pressure will cause rupture of pulmonary bronchial venous connection giving rise to hemoptysis okay next one in asd iota is option a enlarged option b small option c normal option d aneurysmal answer option b small the thoraco thoracic roentgenogram shows mild to moderate cardiomegaly right and right ventricular enlargement prominent main pulmonary segment and a relatively small aortic shadow so in asd iota is small okay hope you understand please comment your suggestions like share subscribe thank you